Electronics Hints heartily welcomes you to know basics of the microcontroller. Always try a little differently. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Receive more electronics information. Kindly suggest your valuable feedback to improve the forthcoming videos. Thank you. The microcontroller is a complete microprocessor system built on a single integrated circuit. It is designed to perform a specific function in an embedded system. The microcontroller has CPU, memories, I.O. ports, timer or counters, ADC, DAC and etc. Simple block diagram of microcontroller is shown below. CPU This is the heart of the microcontroller. The microprocessor has ALU, registers and control unit. The ALU unit performs the arithmetic operations like add, subtract and etc. and logical operations like OR, AND and XOR. Memory The microprocessor has ROM and RAM memories. ROM ROM is a memory that cannot be changed by a program or user. ROM retains its memory even after the computer is turned off. For example, ROM stores the instructions for the computer to start up when it is turned on again. RAM RAM is a first temporary type of memory in which programs, applications and data are stored. Examples of memory Hard disk, USB flash drive and etc. Input output ports. The I.O. ports allow the microcontroller to be connected with the peripheral devices. The ports are bidirectional. The ports consist of a latch, an output driver and an input buffer. Timers. Timers are used to generate accurate time delay or can be used as external counter. Analog to digital converter. This converts the analog signal to digital signal. Serial input output. The serial I.O. is actually two separate registers, a transmitter buffer register and a receiver buffer register. Buses The microcontroller has three buses. Data bus It is a bidirectional bus. The length of the bus depends on the word length. Address bus It is a unidirectional bus. The length of the bus depends on the memory locations. Control bus it is unidirectional. The length of the bus depends on the length of the control signal. Working of a microcontroller A microcontroller is embedded inside a system to control a singular function in a device. It does this by interpreting data it receives from its input-output peripherals using its central processor. The temporary information that the microcontroller receives is stored in the, its data memory where the processor assesses it and uses instructions stored in its program memory to dissipate and apply the incoming data. It then uses its input-output peripherals to communicate and enact the appropriate action. Applications Some of the applications of 8051 microcontroller are mentioned below. Consumer Appliance, Home Applications, Communication Systems, Office, Automobiles, Medical, Defense, Industries and etc. Features of Microcontroller The chip has CPU, Memory, Parallel and Serial Ports, Interrupt Controller, Timer or Counter, Analog to Digital and Digital to Analog Converters. It has numbers of registers. Pins are programmable. It has number of bit handling instructions. It can function as a computer. High speed operation. It can operate boolean function. It cheap and occupies less space. Advantages of microcontroller. The low time required for performing the operation. It is easy to use, troubleshooting and system maintenance is simple. At the same time, many tasks can be performed so the human effect can be saved. The processor chip is very small and flexibility occurs. Due to the high integration, cost and size of the system is reduced. The microcontroller is easy to interface, additional RAM, ROM and input output port. Once microcontroller is programmed, then they cannot be reprogrammed. Without any digital parts, it can act as a microcomputer. It is easy to use, troubleshooting and system maintaining is simple. Disadvantages It is generally used in micro equipment. 
it has a more complex structure as compared to microprocessor the microcontroller cannot interface a higher power device directly it only performed a limited number of executions simultaneously thanks to google and books kindly regret the mistakes in the video thank you for your visit to this channel kindly view the next video